Have you ever read George Orwell's 1984? This book right here? If not, I would highly suggest you check it out. If you're not familiar with it, it's a story about a guy who lives in a tyrannical society in the future where the government controls pretty much every aspect of your life. Now this guy Winston, he sees through all this and he realizes that it's a terrible fate for man in general to suffer. And he says, he wants to get past it, he wants people to get past it, and what he always says is, there is hope in the proles. And what he's referring to is the proletariat. And I would say that in our, or the working class, I would say that in our society, that the proles would be anyone that is of the working class, not well connected to the government, and not overly wealthy. So the vast majority of the Americans. And that makes up a huge majority of people, not just more than 50%, but almost everyone. If we could wake up even a small percentage of the working class Americans to see through all the government BS, everything they tell us, all the media BS, and all the distractions that they feed us, we really could take back the country, take it back to what it was originally stood for. So 300 million Americans... Um, a handful of congressmen and, and CEOs and wealthy businessmen and well-connected people that are in bed with the government. But we still have mostly a democracy, and we still have the power to take it back. But we need to wake people up. There is hope in the proles, and that is the only way we can do it. So tell your friends, tell your neighbors, you need to start having conversations with people. And that is kind of the point of this channel, to put ideas in ways that you can talk to people and point out to them what is wrong with this country, how they've been lied to, and what we can do about it in the future. So the take-home message from this is there's hope in the proles. There's 300 million of us, so many few of, so few of them. We can take back, take back America in, in a matter of a year if we just wake enough people up. So just bring these, bring these subjects up in, in conversation with coworkers, with neighbors. You don't have to go all, all Cujo on them and just berate them, but just, just point out a few things. You know, if you're talking about water cooler talk about, oh, what do you think about the health care bill? Just point out, well, you know, I think that uh, it's it's a bailout for the insurance companies. Really, it's a stimulus for them because, look, Dennis Kucinich, who's a total total liberal, he doesn't support it. So find facts like that out. Find little tidbits that you can point out to people. And just get them thinking. And if they have any more, if they have any questions, say, oh, you know, well, you can go to this. Check this out on YouTube. Just point to them something that really means something to you, and the same way you woke up, they might wake up. So that's all I got for today. Uh, just remember, there is hope in the proles. Till next time. Read 1984.